This is from Sports Illustrated. Ten best landing spots for Dalvin Cook, who the Vikings uh, released earlier today. Number five, they say the Browns. Browns are an obvious scheme fit. Kevin Stefanski was in Minnesota when the Vikings drafted and developed Cook. Browns offense uh, certainly patterned after some of the later year Kirk Cousins Vikings offenses. Kareem Hunt no longer in uh, on the roster. Browns could use a secondary back to take the stress off of Nick Chubb. Uh, Ravens were six. Bengals were eighth on that list as well. Um, and again, you know, Brad. It, it, again, it depends on the price point. Um, the advantage, you don't. Nobody pays running backs very much. Um, I think Cook would. He'd certainly be a, a weapon that would make the offense more explosive. He would. Here's here's my hang up on it. Right, is I just can't see a world where Dalvin Cook's like, yeah, yeah, I want. I'll go <laughs> take second uh, fiddle reps uh, or or second, uh, you know, running back reps from behind uh, Nick Chubb. You know, the best running back in the league. Like that just doesn't seem like. Uh, the best or smartest move for Dalvin Cook as he looks forward in his career, right? Like, I don't know. I, I got to think he could be a one someplace, right? I would agree. And, and uh, to that point, this is from the NFL on CBS. Uh, most 1,100 yards rushing seasons over the last four years. Dalvin Cook has more than anybody. He has four Nick Chubb and, and Derrick Henry um, have three apiece. So three of the last four Chubb and Henry have been over 1,100 all four of the last four, Cook has been over uh, 1,100 yards. That's how good this guy is, and he just got released. And he's, he's 27. He turns 28 in August, so it's not like he's on the other side of 30. It's crazy what they're doing to, or what we are doing in the NFL to these running backs, right? Like a guy like that who has been nothing but productive and, and gets released like that. It, it's, it's a wild um, – and it's just going to continue in that fashion, right? Just because of the propensity for teams to be able to find Isaiah Pacheco's of the world, right? Like that, uh, they can fill in as a uh, seventh round draft pick or UDFAs who uh, can fit in your scheme the way you want and you don't have to pay money to. Wherever a team can shave dollars and still get success, they're going to do so. Um, and a lot of these times, you know, running backs are great and, and they have great talents, but they're often a product of their offensive line and their offense. So, you know, and we're just seeing this more and more. A guy like Dalvin Cook, who's been nothing but great, uh, let go by the Vikings. And, and it seems like the Vikings are uh, maybe heading towards a uh, kind of a half rebuild, retool type thing. So we'll see what they do there. Yeah, and, and again, like you said, really productive. So um, it'll be interesting to see. Somebody's going to get a heck of a running back. Uh, we'll yeah. see. We'll see who it is.